this beautiful tree. It's a grandfather tree. Let the children play. Let the children be free. Bring your children gathered round the fire and read them stories. Read them stories of the past. We'll read them stories of the future. There are stories to be to be had. There are stories to be told. I've got a father with two children walking by. And then we keep going. What's your one? Hmm. Like, look, this is where people get grumpy because it's hard for jazz to be not a lovely game. So you get a point for that game. Okay. Yeah, that's great. Dad's playing with the kids in the game. How appropriate is the timing? The winds of change are coming and will require everyone to be strong and steadfast. Do not be divided. You are seeing the division. It's just ideology. It's just thoughts. Fear and worry about the future. False evidence appearing real. Do not be disheartened. Do not let your hearts get hardened by the upcoming tragedies. These are foretold through the history books. We have called it in. This is a part of the Great Awakening. I feel sad in my heart all of a sudden. But it's okay. Because it's through feeling it, really feeling it. Wow. Really feeling it. That we can transform it. And I know this as a healer. We have to go through it. We have to go through the dark night of the soul. The wind is getting stronger. The winds, the winds of change are coming. The winds of change are here. Do not be disheartened. Do not be disheartened. Young one. I'm the young one. Bring, be strong inside yourself. It's all a game. It just says that father said as he went past, he was talking about a game. You oh. trees always talk about it's just a game and just watch the dualities play out. But I forgot to tell you another piece. You have to go through it and feel it. Observe it. That doesn't sound like I'm pulling away from the game. It sounds like I'm actually in the game. The duality is shifting, changing, being reprogrammed for a brighter future. You have to experience. You have to experience the the dark programming. Dark? Really? You have to experience the dark programming. I don't know if I want to experience that. It's for feeling it that we can change it and alchemize it. It's hard, it's like giving birth. Really? It's like giving birth? Yeah, because you're bringing in the future. 
you're bringing in the future. You're birthing a new era. But we first, you can't just step into the next era and go, okay, here we are. Boop -ba -doo, it's all done. No. You've got to oh, grasp it, change it, feel it, make it. I'm getting a picture of someone like spinning a wheel on pottery and feeling into the mud and the clay and just shaping and forming it. It's all of us as a collective, as much as it's hard when we work together to shape and form it, it can't become such a strong, solid foundation. And then you can look at your creation with pride, saying, look what we did, look what we went through together. I feel emotional about it though. Look at this amazing tree. Let's look at the tree. <laughs> this is incredible. Look at the amazing limbs on this tree. You could have chosen many pathways. You could have chosen many opportunities many options but create creation all together all together as a collective you have chosen this pathway and to be honest they said this is the most ingenious pathway this is the most ingenious pathway now listen to that you chose this And it's the most ingenious way. <laughs> and even though it's really hard, it's actually really, really clever. <laughs> and really smart. This is not in an intellectual way. This is like, all the cards have not been played. I can hear all the trumps have not been played in the card deck. You chose this collectively as a human race. There were options. I don't know why I'm feeling so emotional. I don't know. I don't want to have to stop it. Trees always make me do this. Cry in front of camera. Empath. <laughs> watching you and we're helping you and all the different extraterrestrials and all the other interplanetary dimensions are watching you as you birth this new era gosh goosebumps we're watching you holding you we're not just watching we're actively participating whether you're aware of it or not we're actually actively participating we're actively participating in your growth of a new era and how do you actively participate with us? We're with you every step of the way. We are your guides. We are your angels. We are watching and helping and intercepting when we can. Intercepting when we can. Due to the agreements, we cannot be, uh, as you say, ta um, tangible. We can't be physically here but we can be here in spirit yeah. we can be here in spirit you are a great, you are a great race of people you are a great race we want you to realize that because you've been told that you are smaller than you are and you have been belittled and as you say created into a slave race. You are not a slave race. Yes, this is true. You are a people who have the capacity to be capacity to be so much greater than you are being now. The future is bright. The future is amazing. But this birthing process is hard. Be kind to yourself. Be kind to others.
be kind to others. Sometimes you feel like you want to attack and you want to hurt the other person for their ignorance. Hold back on that because you are all a part of the greater wider whole. Love, you, be, love and be kind to your fellow human beings, no matter what their stance ideologically. Okay. Be kind. Come from the heart. Thank you. Thank you so much. I feel like this channeling's not from a tree. <laughs> this is from a high dimensional being. Thank you.